Occasionally, even in a business environment, you will need to be playing media files. And there are multiple options built right into Windows 10. So of course you do have the default kind of applications here. So when it comes to movies or TV shows or any type of video, you can play that with the movies and TV app. And then with Groove Music, you can play all kinds of audio files. There's a good deal of support built in between these two applications for playing video and audio files. What might be a little bit better in some circumstances would be to use the Windows Media Player, which is also built right into Windows. Of course, most of the things that you can do with this application could also be done with those two applications. Um, however, this application can play both audio and video files, so you don't necessarily need to switch between the two. I find it also to be a little bit more reliable, and it does support larger uh, a larger number of media formats. Now, in addition to that, there are also a lot of third-party applications that you can install, which are trusted and safe to use. Like an application such as VLC is also great for playing both audio and video files, and it supports a very, very large number of formats. There is both a Win32 application, a desktop application like this one from VLC, and then there is also one in the Windows Store as well, which is better for supporting touch controls. Now in terms of actually playing these files, uh, that is also quite an easy matter. So with Windows Media Player, it's going to automatically look for media that is on your system. So I happen to have one song on my system here. I didn't have to uh, import this into Windows Media Player, it just found it on my system automatically. And then if we go to, in fact, if we go to videos, we'll see these videos here that are here just automatically without my needing to import them. And the same would go if I look at pictures. However, if I am browsing with File Explorer and I do want to open a particular file with a particular program, all I have to do is right click and then go down to Open With and then I can choose which program I want to open that with. Um, and it will ask you generally the first time that you do that if you want that program to be the default. So if you would rather use Windows Media Player all the time, all you have to do is check the box that says you want to always open that type of file with Windows Media Player. And you can manage those defaults in your settings application. So we'll just go ahead and search for defaults here. So default app settings, and then we have, so, so this is the default music player, this is the default video player. If we wanted to go ahead and change that to Windows Media Player, we have that option right there. So that's just a, a good deal of information for you about playing media files in Windows 10.